Hey guys, and welcome back to Something Technical UK. Um, first off, sorry I haven't posted a video in a while. Um, it's one, I haven't really had any ideas. Two, it's been too hot. And three, I'm lazy ish, kind of. But I haven't really had any ideas until recently where I had a comment, uh, well, a few comments about my deco installation where there was a few comments about access point mode and yada yada yada. Um, so. This video is in relation to a comment made by a commenter on my, one of my videos um, who wasn't entirely sure how to reset, reboot and back up Virgin Media Router. So yeah, so this video is just about factory defaulting your Virgin Media Router, which you only need to do if your Virgin Media Router is playing up or you're not sure what the password is for the thing. And the password at the bottom of the Wi-Fi router doesn't work. You only need to factory default it. Um, and also if it's playing up and then I'll show you how to back up and then also restore uh, your Virgin Media router so here's a, here's the quick video on to how to restore your Virgin Media um, and then we'll come back to this okay sorry about the mess of wires guys um, this is my network setup. I'm tr I have very limited space, so this is the best I can do. Anyway, so I'm going to show you how to factory default reset your Virgin Media router. What you need to now, I have a slight issue here. I didn't put enough slack on the wire, so I can't really move it any further than that. So what I'm going to do is if I flip it around. Oops. Yeah, that'll fix itself. Um, I'll disconnect this wire so I don't lose anything on the internet uh, on the net. So what you want to do is, this is your Virgin Media Router, obviously. Um, some of you may have the older models, some of you may have the newer models, but resetting them is pretty much exactly the same. Uh, what you will do have is on the bottom, if I can show you, uh, is all your details there. Uh, one of those will be the uh, password to log into the uh, Wi-Fi router. Once you've uh, reset it, I've changed the password, but it's going to default back to that, uh, whatever's written on the bottom there. Um, alternatively, you should have a little card. Ah, yes. Some of them do come with a little card thing, like this. Um, so, Wi-Fi name and Wi-Fi password. A default Wi-Fi name and Wi-Fi password. Obviously, I recommend changing that. Um, if you don't know how to, just let me know in the questions below. Uh, comments below. So what you need to do is there is a small can you see it? Oh, it says reset about there and a little pinhole next to it. What you want to do is grab a little pin and stick it in there but try and see if you can keep an eye on the lights at the front so i've got the slight reflection here you can see so i can use that and just push into the reset button and hold it for about 60 seconds i think it is I've lost count of where I am. Okay, we'll say that's 60 seconds. So, essentially your Virgin Media router should show a white light there. Okay, so that seems to be well on its way back to running up again. Ow. Um, so eventually it should stop blinking. And then I think the lights will disappear altogether, I'm not sure. Um, the only way to figure it out is go and log into your computer and see if that Wi-Fi network pops up. If it does, click connect and then I'll show you what to do. Um, so I'm going to finish this up. Oh, remember to take a picture of your the details underneath because you're going to need it for the Wi-Fi password um, and the login password for this thing. So take a picture um, and I'll join you guys back at the computer. 
Okay, so that's the reset portion, uh, factory default setting of the version meter router done for the moment. So what we need to do now is uh, we need to log into the version meter router. So what you want to do is click on your network icon here. Uh, in my case, there's no internet access. It's not connected to anything at the moment. So if you hover above it, it says unidentified network, no internet access. Click on that and it should load up a list of the version media uh, uh, Wi-Fi networks in your area. Um, so at the bottom of your, if you've taken a photo of the bottom of the Virgin Media Router, it should say a name on there for the Wi-Fi, um, the default Wi-Fi. So my, in my case, it's this one here. Um, so what I'm going to do is click on it and then just click on connect and then type in the password that was uh, hopefully you've taken a photo of. It's also on the bottom of the Virgin Media Router. It's very long and annoying. There we go, and then just click on next. It should connect to it. There you go, connected. So what you want to do next is sorry about that. Uh, oh, go away. Um, then click open up your browser, any browser, Internet Explorer, Chrome, Firefox. Um, uh, also, on the bottom of the version media router, it will say underneath where the Wi-Fi password is. It will say uh, to access the settings page. It will say HTTP colon forward slash forward slash one nine two dot one six eight dot zero dot one. I think that's the same for all version media routers. I'm not entirely sure. So what you need to do in the address bar, just type it in. So it's one nine two dot one six eight dot zero dot one should take you to this page here. So you're going to need to go through the whole setup process again. Uh, next, so choose your language. Um, and then it'll ask you for the password of your hub. Um, so it will be under your uh, Virgin Media Router again. So it will say settings password and the password next to it. Type it in and then just hit next. And then it will ask you to enter a new password. Um, let's Take at the moment. Okay, let's just type in a new password for the moment. Um, okay, and then type it in again below. Hit next. Um, so that will be your new password to log into your router. So this is not your Wi-Fi password, this is your router. Then it will ask you to type it in again. And there you go, you're into your Wi-Fi here. So what you essentially want to do is we're going to look at, so everything's up here. So you've got your, this is the only computer connected at the moment, uh, online here. If you've got telephone connected to it, it should show up here. Um, you can configure your Wi-Fi here, network diagnostics, it's okay. And modify guest network, so we don't want any of this, so we just want to go to uh, admin, reload and reboot, and then just click on backup, and it will download uh, router back data dot backup here. Uh, sorry, router dot data. Uh, click on the little up arrow, or you can just right click on it and it will say show in folder. 
and that will open up on a different page. There we go. So there we go, router.backup here is in my downloads folder. So that's your backup basically done. Save that somewhere or keep it there. You can change the name if you want. I don't, not something I completely recommend or anything like that, but just keep it somewhere safe so you know what it is. Um, to reset your router, um, basically all you need to do is, same again, log into Virgin Media, and then go to admin, and then reload reboot, and then hit select file. Choose the one that you've done, so router.data, and then hit open, it will load up here, and then hit reload, and it will apply everything again. This could possibly take a while. There you go. So everything's been done. If you log back in again. If you type in the correct password and log back in again. Third time's a charm. You think I'd know what I was doing here? Um, that's. Sorry, I think I know what I was doing then. Um, I was being impatient. Um, so what you need to do is just click back on here, and you, so your Wi-Fi essentially reboots um, and then starts back over again. So you need to wait for it to reboot um, five ten minutes. So click on it'll come up again with the name here. Click on connect, and then open up your browser again. Type in the address. And type in the password. And there you go. So yeah, just be patient in the middle. Uh, I may cut that part out. But yeah, basically, so that's how you back up and reset and restore your Virgin Media router. Um, any questions, please ask in the comments below. Um, any video suggestions, please let me know in the comments below. I don't have many ideas. Thank you.